we've actually been impacted for the past few weeks because we already had people who were kind of on the fence, not knowing what was going on around the world, and then sort of saying, you know what, I'm not comfortable, we'll just wait. So we already had people who were thinking that they'd put off their vacations. And since it's actually all come to pass, now we've been trying to bring people back and, um, and then reschedule or, or make cancellations for them. It certainly impacted us. Um, the way that we operate is the tour companies actually provide commissions in the background for us. And so if you don't travel, then we don't get paid. So we've already seen with the cancellations that's been happening. And because we don't know what's going to happen in the coming weeks and months, um, we're just not making those bookings for anybody right now. So for sure, it's going to continue. I think we've been able to provide some assistance to both those that are trying to get back home, those that have had sudden changes to their plans, and then of course moving forward or needing to make changes that sometimes are, well, the last little bit. You know, I need to make changes in 24, 48 hours and phone lines are jammed and we've just been fortunate that we've been able to, yes, we are on hold as well, but just have a little bit of different options in how we're able to, to get through to suppliers and make some changes.